Uh, probably the most fundamental thing uh, I did was we re rewrote the business plan um, from the first Nuku trip um, and that actually set up a whole series of processes in itself because there's one thing writing the plan, there's another thing actually ensuring that you have the ability to de deploy um, and uh, we moved our business model from product innovation, um, still centred on science, but actually more about people in the relationship with um, nutrition. Uh, that, was, that was hugely important. And what we also did is we really had a singular focus in the first year on gut health. Um, and instead of just being an ingredient company, we actually developed a platform for four products in the digestive health, which, which focused on different parts of the gut. So also being part of uh, the Nuku uh, group, it's really focused us in terms of the projects that we want to be involved in over the next five years. Some of these projects include the utilisation of our waste streams. Uh, we're involved heavily um, in the marine space. So what do we do with those mussel cells? Perhaps we grind them up and then now we're putting them onto our vineyards. So that helps with um, soil and water retention. Uh, it's, um, you know, acts as a, uh, I guess, you know, instead of us putting so much herbicide on our, um, on our lands, it's a really great way that we can utilise that particular waste stream. We've got 34 Māori individuals, trusts and corporations or investment, Māori investment vehicles have actually come into this project, which as far as I know is probably one of the biggest collaborative Māori projects that's ever sort of um, come to the forefront. And with the structure we've got, it allows people at whatever size, um, whatever size they are to actually be able to um, participate in this opportunity from right from the very small uh, iwi on the East Coast to the big trusts and corporations like Naitahu or Wakatu or Ngāti Paro. Um, so, uh, so at this stage we're a long way down that track and it's allowed us to um, invest in a lot of offshore um, uh, marketing reporting uh, so we've got people doing a whole lot of work around where the market sits, where the opportunities are. So by everyone putting a little bit of money in we're bound, able to have a look at a very big opportunity which is now really manifesting into a national opportunity in New Zealand. So, so that's just one of the one of a few things that, that, that have come through so far in, in such a short period of time. Just last week we pretty much agreed the final terms for an innovation sale which is a hack centre on technology with um, plant and food um, where we're going to develop second year and third year generation um, uh, respiratory uh, solutions and that's targeting the polluted environment in China. Ken's now busy in the food bowl just developing a different technology around uh, you know, high pressure smoke product uh, which is going to help us even further as well.